Assalamu alaikum everyone. My name is Sharjit Khan and today we had a new topic how to create dynamic navigation using DB table. Uh, when you when already use the application for the built in navigation menu. So if uh, I use the table and create a navigation for the storing purpose. So first of all create a table for the navigation so we create a table this is my table name this is my column menu code menu code menu description and p menu code means parent menu code uh, parent child relation for the navigation is web uh, like yes uh, clause in the table and add the page number and the icon image for the define the navigation icon okay so simple create uh, this table and table create successfully now move on the word file and using this below code in the navigation menu area uh, when table created and we create a form for the insertion a new navigation then perform this sql query for the reflection the new navigation for the showing in the uh, in the application so first of all select uh, the level menu description level level means uh, level menu description and table the this column is used to represent the tab of the hierarchical structure and start start at one from the road nodes and increment for each level and menu description that is uh, this represent the level or name of the minimum item and this code decode connected by this function we use to conditionally return a value based on the value connect by this leaf connect by this leaf if connect by this leaf is zero and an empty string return so otherwise it constrain our url for navigation using apex url syntax now yes is increment yes is increment this column we use to indicate whether the, the menu item is the currently selected one it's set to yes when the condition for the current menu item is made. Now move on the knee NVL icon image for this uh, column. This column is used to represent the image associated with the menu item if icon image is null is default to FA Apex Square icon. Now go to P menu code, P menu code. This column seems to represent a parent menu code is used to establish the hierarchical relationship between menu items. Uh, this is my table name DB menu. And now start with uh, this use hierarchical query with the start with and connected by prior clause with the start row where P menu code is null and connected row based on the relationship between menu code. And B menu code this structure allows to retrieve the radical data. And now move on the last thing my order by siblings uh, clause order by sibling nodes based on the SL column. Sibling nodes are nodes at the same level of the radical. So this code uh, slightly used to retrieve menu item from the radical menu structure in Oracle Apex and it is provide the necessary information to build a navigation menu include labels and url and uh, image the hierarchical structure is defined by the relationship between menu code and p menu code so create copy this code and move on the table application shared component navigation menu and create custom navigation okay and type is dynamic and sql query 
so paste this sql query now compile validation successfully next and now create now move on the create a form now create report with form so first of all create report and include form navigation report record report and navigation form and add the table menu table menu next let's primary key menu code and now create this is my report admin <clears throat> now create go to the this page form page and add menu board because is not a auto increment code so define the menu code and now when we create a new record so first of all before go to the shared component and uh, user interface attribute and scroll down and change the navigation menu custom navigation save look at no navigation so create menu code 1 home parent menu code null because it's the first record for the parent is web yes page number 1 and icon image fa fa dash form one so look at home career successfully now create a second users parent menu ID one is web yes. Now page we define page for this report. For this report, like ten number ten. So define number ten and FA space FA and dash. dash user serial to create look at when user click so go to the page number okay home define this now create last one three departments no parent defined is web yes page number now choose the page number three three 
face space I'll skip the icon and define this. Now create department. Okay, if you choose the child and user uh, department, parent is user. So go to the go to the department and define the parent parent page. Parent menu code ID is two. So define parent ID two. Apply changes. Refresh and look at. So normally we create a dynamic navigation menu using the table and add the icon like uh, apex icon if you use custom icon so use normally you define the global variable and define this class so hopefully you clear the how to create dynamic family navigation menu so thank you for watching video Inshallah, I will meet you the next new topic how to create uh, how to log in database user in application. So, thank you. See you the next video.